So Dean, tell us a story about the Rock Drummer Wanted ad. Okay, well, the incident Drummer Wanted ad, uh, I finally found the guy's house and he was up a flight of stairs and <laughs> parked my chair at the bottom of the stairs there and crawled up, knocked down the door and the guy <laughs> looked out and didn't see nobody. But <laughs> But I was sitting on the ground, and so I said, hey, down here, I'm the drummer. And, and he looked at me like he had three heads or something. And, and <laughs> you're the guy. Zimmer, I'm a rock drummer. I've been playing drums about 30 years at least. And you started with the full kit or you started with bongos? No, I just started playing on my legs and just moved on to the drum set. And Opened up for uh, Fog Hat, Eddie Money, uh, Paul Sticks, Paul Rogers, Kansas, and Thin Lizzy quite a few times. These drum styles are unique, and it partly developed from his unique limitations and what he can do, and it results in what is the tightest pattern on the drum heads that many drum pros have said they've ever seen. He hits the same spot on the head repeatedly, making a pattern like this tight on his snares and toms. And uh, it's just amazing to see him play because when he's playing, he can't just sit there and move his arms and legs like normal. He's a bouncing around, a bouncing around, and it's all part of the motion. And when you see him, you think, oh yeah, this guy's gonna try to play the drums. And then you see him and you go, huh? Oh my God, this guy's amazing. Have you always been in a wheelchair or is this something that happened later or is it from? Yes, it is from birth. I've always been in a wheelchair. I could walk some when I was younger with braces, but when I fell down, I I had a hard time getting up, and, you know, unless there was a chair around or something. So, so the chair just was a little better. He is not handicapped, he is different, and he has the most patience in the world, and he'll, he can do anything anyone else can do, it just takes him longer. Hey, this is, <laughs> Cool. Dean Zimmer, the mean Dean drumming machine. Dean is a song drummer. He, when you play at Nancini's, with the guys, you just play the groove and fill when it needed to be done. Filling into a new section, from a verse to a B section or a B section to a chorus. You wouldn't just go crazy and put fills in the wrong places and showboat. You could have done that, but you, just like Ringo, and many of my favorite drummers, you chose to play the right parts to make the song work. He's really a musical drummer. There's a lot of people can play fast and can showboat, but being musical, Dean, that's something that you, you've got great ears and you're just so musical. Play from the heart, man. Play from the heart, that's it. Play from the heart, yeah. Is that your secret? 
That's about all I ever knew. I mean, they where I went to school, nobody played nothing. I mean, I didn't even have a music class, you know. Usually, I'm um, playing the drums. I can leave. I can get out of this chair and just kind of push it away. And so that's one probably the best way I've found is to <laughs> step out of it somehow or try to leave all the physical stuff behind. Dean, that was fun, man. Was that a blast? Did his lab light fall? You were so great, buddy. You groove. You groove. You're always right there, man. We switched gears a few times. We went to some Jimi Hendrix manic depression, hot for teacher, sing, sing, sing. Wow. Little Bonham. Not John Bonham, Billy Bonham. He lives down the street.